Damn, this is lame. <laughs> oh well, our world's gonna disappear soon, no matter what. I didn't have anywhere to go back to anyways. Everyone's gonna become shadows. <laughs> All humans will become shadows, and I shall descend upon the United World as the Master of Order. Descend? Order? What's with this guy all of a sudden? What's happening? Guys, this isn't Adachi. It's someone completely different! Both this world and yours will soon be enclosed in a fog that never lifts. It will be the peaceful world that mankind has longed for. Who are you? I am Amino Sagiri, one who rules the fog, one awakened by man's desires. Do what you will, but your world's erosion cannot be stopped. It is an inevitability. You played your part well, stirring up the will of the masses into madness. But that will soon come to an end. Mankind will soon become shadows and live on in the darkness of the fog, oblivious of their reality. What the hell are you? Why are you doing this? I am the one that shepherds humans to their true desires. Though their hearts longed for peace, it could never be attained. So they tore down the wall between image and reality. Indeed. This is the outcome desired by mankind, and mankind's desires are my desires. That is why I decided to expand this world. You're saying you're the one who created this nasty-ass world? This is part of the sea of unconsciousness that exists within human hearts. A hollow forest born from bloated desire and false imagery. Humans view things as they see fit. They wish not for truth, but rather prefer the undesirables be hidden in fog. Still, humans fear what they cannot see. That brief yearning for truth becomes a ray of light which breaks the fog and torments the shadows. That's why they attack and kill whoever's nearby at that time. A hollow forest. Then, this place isn't simply affected by people's hearts. It actually exists inside them? Mankind abandoned its pursuit of truth, placing itself in the depth of chaos and falsehood. Thus, my strength has grown, and the fog will not lift. Your world will be engulfed by the hollow forest. Will you shut up already? We'll just use our power to beat the heck out of you and it'll all be over! It was I who made it possible for you to bring about this destiny. I bestowed power onto those who could brave the Hollow Forest. That is what allowed you to come in contact with this world. And you all have done very well since. Bestowed power? Contact with this world? You mean the power to enter the TV? Then the Midnight Channel, was that phenomenon also your doing? Humans fail to see things as they truly are. They choose to see only what they wish. I acted only in support of this. A world filled with desires, viewed through a window from which one sees what one wishes to see. Humans departed from reality of their own volition, craving more false images. A window that shows people what they want to see. So that's why those who got famous suddenly appeared on the Midnight Channel, one after another. It was all in people's minds. I have to say, it must be true. The Midnight Channel we saw in Namatame's hospital room, that kept bothering me since. What we saw there wasn't Namatame's true intentions at all. Then it came on because we were all thinking, this person must be the killer, he can't be forgiven? <laughs> we let ourselves be deluded. Exactly. The more false images one yearns for, the more one stops yearning for reality. And so the forest grows on. That is the expansion of this world. Enough talk already! Long story short, you're the one behind all this! Yeah, I don't know who you are, but you're going down! 
People want to become shadows? Their desire is your desire? To hell with that! When did we wish for that crap anyways? We kept fighting and fighting like morons to get where we're standing. Yes, that I did not foresee. The ability to master your own shadow that emerged to kill you and use its power. A new and uncertain facet of mankind. Is it worthy to put my trust in? Or not? It must be tested. what you want so far, but that'll end when we crush you! Precisely. Then we know what we gotta do now. I don't want people to turn into shadows! We'll defeat it for sure! I'll back you up with everything I've got! This thing has no right to exist! Me as a senseless act which goes against your world's wishes. Now, let everything vanish into the sweet fog of illusion. This is the end. This time, it's all over. Let us begin.
Kun, oh, this isn't good. Sora! Tokun's hurt pretty bad. Can you heal her? Persona is sealed. for the fall to lift. Why act against the wishes of your fellow man? Consider, is that truly just? Guys, you're really low on health. Let's go! will draw many back into suffering and strife. Why will you not understand this? Let's go! Persona! There! 
Here goes Kanzeon!
soon! Oh, this isn't good! Shouldn't someone heal Yukiko-senpai? <laughs> Careful, guys. You're really low on health. <laughs> guys, Chie-senpai's really hurt. are strong. Power comes from the heart. You have proven to me human potential. Very well. I will lift the fog from the place where you will return to. Mankind's desires are my desires. If mankind so wishes, I will return at any time. I am always at your side, watching. Well, don't wait up! We'll keep that from happening no matter what! Time will show the path humanity takes. Children of the new potential. You think... It was controlling Adachi-san? Who can say? I believe it was at least partially his own intention as well. <sighs> so that's it, huh? <clears throat> hmm. Fine. Live however you want. If you think you have the power to change the future, then go right ahead. Everyone has the power to do that. Get out of here. The shadows will finish me off. Just leave me be. You came to kill me in the first place, didn't you? No, dumbass. If we leave you here dying, and a dead body eventually appears, then what? What's that accomplished for anyone? Your stupid game's over. We're taking you back. Live and face your punishment. That's how it works in our world. Right. I'm sure that's the outcome Dojima-san wishes for as well. We have the same power, but things turned out so differently for us. Friends, huh? <laughs> that's the last thing I want to hear about right now. Maybe if I had been more like you, 
Things wouldn't have gone this way. Let's go back. Greetings, Shirogana-san. We got word from Detective Dojima. He's wanted on suspicion of murdering Mayumi Yamano and Saki Konishi, right? Correct. Understood. We have an ambulance waiting downstairs. Should we have them bring the stretcher up here? An ambulance? Detective Dojima assumed one would be necessary. He wanted the suspect to be carefully taken into protective custody. It... Well, it was a personal favor to him. They were partners, after all. Then yes, please have them bring up the stretcher. Understood. For real. What's up, Senpai? Did you think I was crying? It's just so bright. It's been so long since the sky was that blue. It's finally over. It took us a long time to get this far. But, well, this means we've won. Huh? What are we doing? Ooh, what's this? Everyone ready? Here goes! We did it! Woohoo! Why didn't you guys say it? You all joined in when Risa John did it! Um, I think that was a little too hard to get on the spot. Which part did you mean for us to say? Can we just do it over? Man, having to redo something like this kind of kills the fun of it. All right, Chia, do that weird call again. Not if you're going to call it weird. <laughs> um, people are beginning to stare. I don't think we should stay like this much longer. Um, my hand's getting kind of sweaty. Sheesh. Fine, then. It's all yours, Sensei. Aren't you supposed to do this before you start something, not after it's over? Huh? Who cares? 